With those changes to my deck, that should be just what I need to win this next duel. One more star chip. I can't believe it. Then I'll be in the tournament. I'll be able to win the prize money. Maybe even fight Pegasus. Uh, start my dig. Everything is going perfectly. Something feels weird though. My bed was uncomfortably warm today. It's like someone else has been sleeping in it. Oh well. Let's uh, get out of here, find someone to duel. But everyone's been flocking off the island. Someone's been taking them all out. And, well, I took a few of them out, not gonna lie, but not quite as many as I've been leaving. I suppose I'm never gonna figure out how to get out of here properly. This whole island's like a maze. No. Come on, maybe there's stairs or something somewhere. Wait. I know where I am. I know where I am. Yes, there we go. But I can't go on the arena because I haven't gotten my star chips yet. There we go. Now we can get out of here. Okay. Ah. Uh, there's not many people left to duel. I heard things about that guy. He's probably not the one I want to go up against. So maybe we can get some, uh, some new cards. Wait. Let's be honest here. I don't think he's going to have any cards. But I have to try. Let's do this. Keeper of cards. I know we haven't gotten along too much, but what do you got for me today? You, you can't be closed. You're never closed. You're standing right there with cards behind you. Look, man. Just, I have nine star chips. You can't be treating me like this. You weird looking blue eyed, not white dragon. Look, your head looks like a dirt block. Look at this. That's pretty much a dirt. Hold on. Hold on one second. Let me just, let me just uh, get one of these. Okay. And boom. That's your head. See? Exactly the same. You just match the stupid dirt block. There. Keep your little brother. Ugh. Man. Can you at least tell me where I can find another duelist? Oh. Hey. Hello. You were standing there the whole time? Yeah. I was just waiting in line. Oh. Well. Yeah, I see you have star chips. How many do you yeah, have? I got nine of them. What nine? Oh, I have nine as well. Oh, this could be fate. Just one, just one left. Yeah. I've hardly seen any other duelists left on the island. At I least am. not ones that I haven't beat already, so... Oh, he's confident. Eh. Some of the people are still around is all. But how about you and me have a duel? Winner gets their tenth star chip. Yeah, okay. Let's do it. Alright, so I guess we only need to throw one star chip on the line, nice and easy. Yeah. Okay. There's one arena that I saw that we didn't ha get to try out yet. It's on the mountain. So we should go nice. find it. So uh, what kind of that. deck you have? Uh, I've got, you know, a few warriors. You know, okay. Some nice fusions. Ooh. Don't want to give too much away. Ah, to fair enough. Character. I mean, I guess I, I'll tell you I have some nice dinosaurs waiting for you. Oh, a dino deck. Yeah, a couple fusions myself, but don't really get to use them all that often. Uh, it really comes down to using cards like my Tyranno Infinity or my Black Tyranno. Ah, uh, see so you giving away your secrets. Eh. Well, once they're out on the field, I don't know if you can do much about them anyway. We'll see. Hmm. <laughs> Seem confident. I am. I guess you have to be fairly good to get this far. Yeah, I've got nine star chips, and I'm gonna get my tenth right now. <laughs> Not if I get my tenth. Ah, there's the arena. It's right up there. We're gonna have to climb our way up, though. Quite a long climb. Yeah. It'd be nice if they had uh, some clear paths for us, but I guess that's part of the challenge. Yeah. Trying yeah. to find the do lists around this place. No wonder you can't find any. Yeah. Probably lost. <laughs> yeah, there might be like four or five duelists just sitting there <laughs> with star chips that haven't been won yet, just wandering around the island. Uh, but here we are. Yeah. Ooh, uh, mountain arena. This could be interesting. Yeah, we should have the field advantage. Should be on my side. Mm, maybe it will. Can't see much advantage on my side from here, but we'll make do anyway. Are you ready? Yeah. Alright then, let's duel. It's time to duel! duel. Alright. I'll take the first move. Ooh. Okay. 
some pretty good cards already. I think I we're going to uh, summon my Yurabi in attack mode. And I think I'll hold on to my other cards for now and end my turn. He only drops 1500 attack points. It's not that scary. Well, he can be when you make him angry. So I think I'll set one card face down and activate polymerization. What? A fusion already? And I'll bring out Elemental Hero Marina by sacrificing Avion and Bubble Man. Ooh. In attack mode. Hmm. Still not strong enough to take out my Eurobee. And I also activate the face down I placed. He did heart, which gives me an extra 500 attack points. Okay, now he is strong enough to take out my Eurobee. Oh man. Hmm. Solid move. Now end my turn there. I should have played all my cards. Uh, but with that effect, he now has lower attack points. That is true. Mm hmm. So. I think I'll play a little defensive here. And set a surprise for you. Your move. Hmm. I'll just place one card face down and end my turn. I don't want to risk attacking your face down. Yeah? Probably for the best. I'm going to summon my two headed King Rex in attack mode. He'll be strong enough to take out your Mariner. It's 300 attack points. Mm hmm. Use your two headed chomp attack! Right. life points left. I still more than you. Eh. I'm still confident. That'll even things out a little bit. I will place one card face down again, and I'll end my turn there. Alright. Defensive. Interesting. Okay. I'll set a card down as well. And attack that new monster with my two-headed King Rex. Damn it. Ooh. He could have been strong enough to take on my Rex. Yeah, but then I would have had to lose him too. It wasn't worth it. Well, now you've lost him anyway, and my two-headed King Rex is still on the field. That's true. But I'll normal summon a never spark man. Ooh. And I'll take King Rex down with me. Alright. Good move. Looks like we're both defending now. It's on the defensive till we get the right cards. Mm hmm. Speaking of which, sounds like I just got the right card. Oh no. I'm going to set down one more monster and end my turn. Huh, okay. Interesting. Hmm. I'll place the field card face down. And face a monster, down. and end my turn. Why would he place a field card face down? It doesn't matter. The field right now looks like a benefit for me. So, I'll summon my Frostosaurus. 2600 attack points? Mm hmm. Let's see either of your defensive monsters resist this. Alright. Use your Frost Breath attack! They would before, but now. That's impossible to defend. Mm-hmm. What could be that field card you have? Hmm. I'll play Swords of the and Light to keep you at bay for three turns. Hmm. And you get to take a peek at my Marigold Jurassic Egg. I'll end my turn there. I'll be safe for three more turns. Mm-hmm. But only three. Uh, if I could attack you, I could get rid of those swords. But I'll end my turn. I'll place one cap face down, and I'll end my turn. Hmm. I'll place a card down as well. And end mine. The swords will only protect you for so long. Hmm. I think I'll flip some of my elemental hero Blaze Man 
Hmm. Let me set that down. Then I'll end my turn. Why? Huh. I think you have some big moves planned here. I think so. Yeah. But I may have one to counter it. So I'm going to use my Frostosaurus next turn. <laughs> my swords are gone, so I have to have to think quick now. Yep. Or switch your Blaze Man back to defense mode. I could. But instead I'll sacrifice my Blaze Man and my Woodsman to summon Elemental Hero Blade Edge. Twenty six hundred attack points. And then, I'll also activate Skyscraper. Huh. Well, there's that field card. And I'll attack your Frostosaurus. Wait. He's still gonna kill himself. Yeah, that's fine. But he's out of the way. Skyscraper's for later. Hmm. Very well, then. Looks like I'll set another trap. And... Since you have nothing on the field, I have nothing to worry about. I'm gonna activate Miracle Fusion, which means I can banish cards from my graveyard in order to make a fusion summon. Huh. Interesting. Well, while you're at that, I think I might as well activate my Fossil Excavation. That means I can discard a dinosaur card from my hand, and bring out my Frostosaurus. Not oh, the Frostosaurus again? He's back! Damn it. But if you get rid of the fossil excavation, he'll go away as well. There is a downside. Hmm. I think I'll bring out Elemental Hero Tempest. In attack mode. 2800 attack points. Oh no. Now, I'll get rid of your Frostosaurus. Ah. Take him. Alright, end my turn. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to activate the effect of Miracle Jurassic Egg. Okay. What does it do? It lets me discard a card. Or rather, discard him. And since you sent so many of my monsters to the graveyard, I get to special summon one from my deck. Oh. And I think I'll go with... You can't have any powerful more than 2600 uh, attack points. You're right. Hmm think I'll bring out my destroyer Saurus. Interesting choice. Yep, interesting indeed. Let's see. Unfortunately, I can't activate his effect which would turn us all into a Jurassic World, but I can go ahead and end my turn after playing this card. Hmm, what could that face stand be? Well, it could be something very important, or it could be a distraction. Hmm. I'll place one card face down. And I'll give you the benefit of the day this turn. Because <laughs> I'm, I don't want to attack with that face down you just placed. Hmm, wise move. However, not wise enough. I'm going to activate another fossil excavation. Who, we, who can you bring out? Well, I can go ahead and bring back the Frostosaurus. Still not enough to beat my Tempest. No, not for now. But, I have the card that'll make him just strong enough now. I activate Jurassic World. Jurassic World? Yep. That makes this just enough to take out your elemental hero Tempest. So I can't defend against that. I think we'll take him out now. 
I've only lost 100 life points so. uh, But I think you'll lose more this turn when I attack with my Destroyer Saurus and activate Meteor Rain. What does Meteor Rain do? It means even though he's in defense mode, you can still lose life points. What's your 300? Looks like it's a tie game now. And I have no monsters on the field. And nothing strong enough to withstand my Frostosaurus. Maybe coming to this cold mountain was a good idea after all. Hmm. Ah, uh, I... I'll set one card face down and I'll end my turn. Hmm. Alright. Well, I guess we'll just clear out that card with my Destroyer Saurus. Alright, give him that bladed head attack. Wow. Really? Damn it. At least you don't have Meteor Rain that time. Yeah, I only have one of those cards. But you'll run out of ways to defend yourself soon enough. I'll have to take Fusion Reserve. Oh. It allows me to reveal my Fusion Monster and add one of the material monsters from my deck to my hand. Another one of these tricks. Okay. I think I'll choose Phoenix Enforcer and I'll bring my Bustinatrix. Hmm. And also add one Polymerization from my graveyard to my hand. Oh, you still need the other monster though to make a successful summon. That is true. I think I'll play one card face down as well. Hmm. Oh. Now we can see you squirm. Alright, since my fossil excavation is a bit of a weakness, I'm going to go ahead and sacrifice my Frostosaurus to bring out my super ancient dino beast. 3,000 attack points? Yep, the highest attack monster in my deck. And of course, that Jurassic World raises it to 3,000 from 2,700. I don't have anything that can beat that. Hmm, well then, looks like you're in trouble. Let's attack. No. Dinner tricks. So much for that summoning plan. I'll place one card face down. I'll end my turn. <laughs> Running out of monsters, are we? Maybe. Well, I have plenty. I'm gonna I sacrifice goodness. my Destroyer Saurus to bring out a Big Tusk Mammoth. Now, he may not have the damage Destroyer Saurus does with that Jurassic World out. But I think a mammoth will do good here. I can only set one card face down. And I'll land my turn there. Hmm. This card won't do me any good here. But, I think I'll attack that face down card with my mammoth. Ah, foolish. They've got the same attack as your defense. <laughs> my defense. It doesn't matter if I attack with my super ancient dino beast. Yeah. You almost got away with that one there. Not much I can do. I'll activate Queen of the Swamp's effect. Hmm. Which means I can use that card to substitute it for any fusion monster. But Keep moment, talking about all these fusions, but I'm not seeing much ever since I took out your last one. <laughs> oh man. I think I'll hold on to this card for now. And see what you have in store. I need a monster. I'll end my turn. There's nothing I can do. Alright. I guess it's a waiting game then. an awful lot of magic cards you have on the field. I'll set one more. <laughs> I'll end my turn. Oh. Bad news is you have so many. Good news is I guess you can't play any more. That's so, true. I'll bring out my two-headed King Rex. Two-headed... Okay. I'll activate Compulsory Evacuation Device. 
I can target one monster on your field and return it to your hand. And I'll uh, choose Super Ancient Dino Beast. Hmm. Not if I activate my Jurassic Heart. This only works if I play it against a card that targets one of my dinosaurs. So, you targeted the wrong monster. It would have worked fine on my mammoth. That was my last hope, I think. Unless, I'll activate Emergency Call, which means I can add one hero from my deck to my hand. <laughs> you already I said you don't have anything strong enough. I'll choose Spark Man. And now, I'll activate Polymerization. Ooh. To bring out Elemental Hero Thunder Giant by sacrificing Clayman and Spark Man. Alright, strong, but not strong enough for my Dino Beast. Yeah, but he has a special effect. Once per turn, I can discard one card and target one monster on your field with a less attack and destroy it. Wait. Don't discard Necroshade and get rid of your big tusk mammoth. Ah. Oh. That While means I'm you're free to attack. I'll take out King Headed Rex. Ah. Uh. Down to 900, 900 life, points. life points left. Yeah. But you left your Thunder Giant on the field. Yeah. I'm gonna lose him this turn, but. Hmm. It was worth it to clear out your field. Alright then. I think I'll do you a favor and clear yours as well then. Let's go ahead and take out that elemental hero thunder giant. Right. 800 life points. Yep. And just to make sure I have more than one monster on my field, I think I'm going to activate Gillisaurus's special effect and special summon it to the field. However, that means you can bring something back from your graveyard. Hmm. I'll bring back my blade edge. Alright then. In attack mode. Well, we know he's not strong enough to take out my dino beast. That's but true. Before I end my turn, I'll sacrifice the Gillosaurus for another card. Why would you put him face down? Oh, maybe I don't want you to see him. Maybe he's a surprise. Okay then. Well, I'll attack. Your super ancient dino beast. Why? Dice River's effect adds a thousand attack points to me if his attack is lower. But. Ooh. Just took out my strongest monster. Hmm. Huh? Well, guess we're here to play risky, aren't we? We only need one star chip each. Yep. Going to activate Fossil Dig. What does that do? Let's me bring out one dinosaur card from my deck to my hand, as long as it's less than six stars. And I'm gonna bring out my favorite card, the Tyranno Infinity. What? And summon him to the field. Let's see, what else can we do? Well, just to keep you guessing, I'm going to activate Ray's Body Heat on him. To make him a little bit stronger. And then my turn. Six hundred attack points, though. Well, if you're willing, go ahead and attack. You know mm. I have three cards face down, though. I'll just activate Heart of the Underdog. Hmm. What'll that do? When it's my draw phase, I can draw one more card, but I have to show it to you. I guess that may help you out. I'll just end my turn. Alright. rest attacking. Suppose you don't. I'm gonna set down another card. And I'll end my turn. As soon as you attack. I think I'll just end my turn. Hmm. Alright, I can't play any more of my magic cards, so I'll end mine as well. Hmm, I'll set one card face down. A 
And I'll let my two in there. Ooh. This should make him just strong enough to take you down. Alright. I think I'm going to sacrifice my sword arm of dragon and Tomazaurus to put it down another card. Face down again? Yeah, but that's not the important thing here. Don't worry, I think your time is up. Now that I have plenty of monsters in my graveyard, I activate Survival Instinct. What does that do? Well, see how I have only 300 life points right now? Watch it rise as I remove every dinosaur card from my graveyard. Raising my life points. Infinity. And well, raising his attack higher than it's ever been before. That's impossible. Oh, it's possible. Let's play a, uh... A mystical space typhoon on this middle card just to make sure nothing happens. No. Okay, that may not no. have helped too much. But I'll go ahead and attack your elemental hero, Blade Edge. No! With Tyranno Infinity's attack. 12 times Blade Edge! <laughs> Looks like that star chip is mine. Yeah, it was a good deal. Alright. There you go. Well, I guess you still here's have eight star chips left. Yeah. Here's your, here's your star chip. Alright. You can get into the into the kingdom now. Yeah. Into the finals. Oh, I can't believe I've already gotten a place in the tournament. I'm wondering what kind of people I'll find there. Well, I think I'm going to go and try and find another challenger. I need to get my two star chips now. Alright, good luck. Maybe I'll see you in that finals. Yeah. And I'll win next time we fight. <laughs> we'll see. Oh, huh. that was a good duel, but what's this? Is that a skeleton of some kind? Looks like a spine or something of a giant creature. Huh. wonder what other secrets are hiding on this island. You know what? If I get that prize money, if I get to duel Pegasus, maybe... Maybe I can get the right to uh, do a little excavating in the kingdom. Who knows what might be here? If it was set up for dueling, surely there's been no archaeology going on. Could have something to do with the cards. Could have something to do with the game. Or, it could just be a really cool dinosaur. Alright, so let's head down here. Guess he's trying to make sure his deck is perfect for his next duel. He had some good cards, but nothing to take on my Tyranno Infinity. But I guess nothing can take on my Tyranno Infinity. To this point, he's been unbeatable. If something can't get that many attack points, at least nothing I know can get that many attack points. 12,000. Oh. I want to see anyone in the championship try to beat that much. I want to see them s just try to beat my Tyranno Infinity. And even if I can't bring out my Tyranno Infinity, I still got my Black Tyranno, my Super Ancient Dino Beast, and my Sword Pod Brachion to win the game. Uh, I think this tournament might be as good as mine, and as soon as I win, we can start our excavation and get back to studying more dinosaurs. It's good stuff. Whew. Oh, hey, you. Oh, hey. I haven't seen you since the start. Yeah, it's been a little bit of time, but uh, oh. been a lot of duels since then. Yeah, so how about me and you? Uh, you and me duel? Exactly. It's about time, right? So, so when I come in here the first time and I need a duel, you decline me. But now, now you're asking me for a duel, huh? It was raining. Okay, it was <laughs> absolutely hammering it down. I was never going out there. Oh, well, I went out there, and you know what? Now I have ten star chips. What? Yep. You've got your ten already? Yep, ten star chips. <sighs> Who did you knock out? <laughs> Quite a few people, I'd imagine. <sighs> this is not. You got here late. Yeah, sorry. I just happened to... You know what? Yeah, I just happened to win every duel I've been in. You didn't have ten. I would change that so fast. Uh-huh, but since I have ten, I guess I don't really need to duel you. So... Uh, now I have to find somebody else. <laughs> I mean, it would be almost worth it just to duel you to get rid of those star chips of yours, but... Eh. Probably not worth the risk. Who knows, you may even be as good as that dragon duelist, but... Dragon? Oh, Tiger. Yeah, he that was, was his name. He beat you? Yeah, that Tiger <laughs> dragon came out of nowhere. 
I had the upper hand Ooh, the entire duel. Five headed dragon. Right there's an attack. Got me right off guard. Ooh, spooky, spooky. Uh well, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put you down with anything else. But uh yeah, good luck finding another duelist. How many star chips you say you have? I've got six. Ooh, cutting it close, aren't we? Whoever I find next, I'm betting four. Alright, well, good luck. Hopefully you don't get knocked down to two. Oh, who's who's this? Huh? Oh, that so was I the guy I just duel. Ooh, this could be a good matchup. Do you have some star chips? Uh yeah, I've got six. So Eight. have I. Perfect. Oh man. I'll leave you two to your duel. And I will go it. prepare my deck. Well four I star chips. two. Four four star chips. I did yeah.